Thank you so much, Auntie. Well, I'm sharing my satsang for the first time. Thank you, Guruji, for the opportunity. And uh, I hope you'll pardon me if I make any mistake. It's been lovely since the time we, I, at least me and my, uh, my husband, have got connected. Uh, 2014 was the first time when my friend did a satsang at her place, and she also got connected through someone, which is uh, Anju auntie. I just met her, uh, coincidentally, right now uh, in the kitchen. So she got connected through her. And uh, Shalu auntie, who's a very close and dear friend to me, she was doing satsang. And uh, since in our friend circle, nobody knew about Guruji, and she was doing it for the first time. She asked everyone to support her. And um, I said, OK, fine, because I am, I'm from a Punjabi Sikh family. We have our uh, Guru Nanak Dev, and uh, we follow uh, Gurdwara, and uh, we go there, listen to Shabad. So that has been the journey for me since my childhood. So this was a little different kind of a request, but since she was such a dear friend, I said, OK, fine, I'll, I'll come for you. I asked my uncle. Uh, he said, you know what, uh, you go ahead. Uh, I know that uh, we can't say no to Shalu, so you go ahead and we'll see. I said, OK, fine, I went. Moment I entered, I didn't know the setting, the discipline, and how it is supposed to be done, because in my life, I never went to any satsang except Gurdwara before that. That was my first, very first, first time. I used to listen to people going to satsang in India, but I didn't know what they do over there. OK, they must be listening to uh, some something, uh, some bhajan, but that's all I could think of. As I was there, I saw that there is a Punjabi in Punjabi. And that is exactly what I have lived my life. And I said, this is something which I can relate to. OK, it would be easy for me to sit there. I sat, and uh, it was beautiful. I could uh, easily do my dhyan. And uh, when I finished from there and I came back, I was just mesmerized with the whole environment and the aura. And I came back home uh, telling my husband that I was very happy. If it will happen, you will have Unfortunately, within a month, Anju auntie did satsang, and this time I took my husband with me. And he attended it, and when he came back with me, he had exactly the same, same feeling, same, uh, same calmness that you get once you go back. And I'm sure you all must be feeling that's why we all are here connected to Guruji, because the peace and the calmness that you get from your entire uh, work week, and when you come here and sit here for whatever uh, minutes and hour that you, you are here for, that calmness we felt when we reached home, and we didn't talk the entire time in the car with each other. He, he reached home, and he said to me that I loved it, and let's go again whenever the satsang happened. And we used to, we started waiting. He koi satsang mein bulai, kyunki humko to pata hi nahi tha ki yahan pe mandir, gurdwara mein kahi kuch, kuch koi information koi deta hi nahi hai. To hume pata nahi tha ki koi guruji ka mandir bhi hai. Fine. Moving on. Uh, we got connected. The journey was very nice and peaceful and beautiful. Uh, like, I used to listen to satsang and people's journey, within that journey, so many changed for them. So many things changed for them. At least for me, the journey was like going steady. There was no, there was nothing I was asking Guruji also. I was just asking, just give us health and uh, calmness in our house. And I know that we, we work hard, so we will do whatever we deserve. And uh, we'll get that. So it's OK. Just give us our good health. That's it. And uh, one day, uh, in that journey, and I, it was not that uh, uh, late that I connected to Guruji. It was very, very recent in that time that uh, I, I'm from IT background. I applied for a job. I keep applying, and I applied for a job in, um, in UN, United Nations. And uh, fortunately, I get picked for an interview, and I clear my interview, and they ask me, Ki aap join karlo. 
I said, okay, fine. When they started talking about how the process is, they said, and like anyone else here, I, I do not know, many of you must be, must have gone through the journey of H1, H4, green card and all that. And we were in the same journey. I, I was holding an H1. I had uh, filed for my green card. My uncle had his own H1, his own green card process. So we didn't want to disrupt that. And I was told that you have to visa pe aana padega. Because the, the position that I was getting over there, it was a country diplomat. So I said, that's a very, very big offer. I wouldn't have said no ever in my life if I would have, come, if I, if I would have been picked in India and come straight on that visa here. But since I was in the middle of my green card processing, I didn't want to disrupt anything. So ek wo bhi greed tha, aur ek ye bhi tha ki itna bada offer hai, should we say no to it? We, I had time for a week, and we were debating about it. But the, on the final, final day, me and my husband, we were going uh, somewhere. And I said, you know, only four, five hours are left. I have to give them answer by 5 PM this evening. Tell me, what do I do? Should I take it or should I refuse it? And uh, he said, you know what? Tu itna satsang jati hai, aur itne ye satsang tu mujhe bhi sunati hai, aur roz sunti hai. तो खुद क्यों नहीं इस बात को आ, सोचते कि तू अपने गुरुजी से एक बार बोल कि मतलब कैन यू शो मी आल्सो सम पाथ लाइक समथिंग सम काइंड ऑफ इंडिकेशन मैसेज समथिंग एंड आई सेड पता नहीं वो लोगों के साथ होता है हमारा शायद इतना कनेक्शन नहीं है हमें हमारे साथ होगा नहीं होगा अब मेरे पास चार घंटे मैं क्या करूं तो एंड वी आर ड्राइविंग एंड वी आर टॉकिंग एंड देन वी गो साइलेंट फॉर 2 मिनट्स बिकॉज़ ओके फाइन वी हैड व्हाटएवर द डिस्कशन and right there and then the car comes in front of me and the car license plate says G42 EAD. I, I have a picture in my phone till date for that. I took the picture and after taking the picture, I, I told my husband, check the license plate. What license plate? I said, just ahead of us. And he goes, G42 EAD. And I said, that's the visa that we are talking about. Oh, yeah. So I said, I've got my message. I'm picking up the job. That's it. I get my G4, you get the EAD. That's what it says. And then uh, you continue your green card process. Mine is going to get quit because I'm going to become uh, a, a diplomat, a representative of India here. So I'll continue to do that. And I picked up the job. And this was back in 2014 when I, when I picked my job. Six months, it was that I got connected to Guruji before that. I said, shukrana Guruji for everything and glad that I picked it because I didn't know what all I was getting into. What kind of responsibility I am taking on from there on and how my career is going to move and shift. And uh, it's just not that you get the diplomat title here and you know you are a country representative not it doesn't end there when you are in a UN family and when you are working for such a big international organization you are given the privileges to do things that you I think in every child and in every mother would be thinking of telling their child to become something like that and I was debating on that offer whether I should take it or not I mean, I never asked my dad, I never asked my mom, I never called back India to discuss this with them. I was discussing just over that thought of a green card disruption with my husband. That's it. And today, I, I make my, my husband proud, my, my parents proud, I feel good. And the work that I'm doing, that makes me feel even more good. And that everything that I did, Thank you, Guruji, for letting me make that decision, making that decision easier for me. It wasn't an easy one. And I couldn't have taken it without him because uh, I, I would have certainly said no. Certainly, if that, that message would have, wouldn't have been there in front of me. So that's my small and beautiful satsang. But uh, another thing that I would like to say uh, to each one of you, which I just got to know today. And I'm, you know, uh, today is my very, very first time that I'm doing satsang in front of anyone. I have been connected to Guruji since 2014. I have been coming to uh, Mandir. I used to go to Oak Tree Mandir and then I started here. 
No one ever asked me to do satsang before. <laughs> so I, I was like you, coming here, sitting here, uh, putting my time here with my Guruji, having that connection, having beautiful time here. And uh, I don't know how many, how many festivals I experienced in this beautiful environment. But nobody, very strongly, if you are chosen, and if Rita Auntie is coming to you, I'm sure that you have been chosen by Guruji because she is also going in the direction what Guruji has directed. And uh, today it was my turn. I'm thankful. And when it, whenever it's your turn, please share your satsang because you never know who would get benefited with that eventually. I did my satsang. Maybe somebody gets the message with that something. But I usually do when I sit here. And I, I really appreciate the people who come up here and do their satsang. Thank you. Thank you, Guruji. Jai Guruji. Om Namah Shivaya, Shivaji Sadasa. Om Namah Shivaya, Guruji Sadasa.